a little peanut. Tell us a little about the day in the life of being a peanut. Well, if you really want to know, I have fun all the time catching birds and and you know, I like to hide my cookies and bury them in the in the plants and this is very, very, very fun. What else do you have for me? Come on, hot shot. <laughs> What's so funny? And uh, do you have any love interests? Well, one of the birds I chase, she is my love. I can't imagine life without her. Her name is Egoret. What else? Come on, come on. But it's been it's been seen and witnessed that there are about two other birds. Who are they? Those are my other girls. You know, I have them on the side. But Igoret is my one true love. Oh. And how have, how have you been coping with about jingles? The loss of jingles? Oh, I don't even remember him. I mean, who is who is Jingles? I don't know. But truthfully, I do have dreams about my wiener. How oh, can you not remember him? You lived with him for six years. I have a peanut head. What do you expect, <laughs> woman? I don't know. Who is this? Any relation to Ren? Oh, well, now that you bring that up, I do remember my brother Jingles. I was Ren and he was my stampy. No. Why you make me sad? <laughs> And how do you feel about the loss of the Chihuahua Spokes dog for Taco Bell? I heard that's very sad in the Chihuahua community. Not for me. I'm going to get my food in the door. I send my resume and my pictures. I am so in the door. And, yeah, my mommy sent my pictures with the taco, and I think I have a chance. What future aspirations do you have for yourself living here in Sunnyvale with, with your family? I just like to lay around. I don't have any plants. What are you talking about? All plants? I don't have plants. Look, you're getting me mad. I'm gonna go. No more of this. <laughs>